Good evening. I am Tara Fogel, the coordinator of summer school programs for the Greenwich Public Schools. I would like to thank Dr. Jones, Chairman Kelly, our Board of Education members and listeners this evening. I speak tonight on behalf of myself and Dr. Ann Caravillo and our entire summer school team. We are excited to share our plans for summer school beginning next month. To begin, I will outline our goals for the summer program. Let me start with K-8. We are focusing on literacy and numeracy for our academic invited students. We invited over 1,200 students based on academic priority, literacy needs, ELL level one and two students, and special education students who have extended school year services on their IEPs. I would also like to add that we are offering five incredibly popular math acceleration courses for middle school students. In our nine to 12 program, we are focusing on credit recovery of core graduation requirements and acceleration opportunities. We continue to provide robust services for our special education and community connection students 912. This summer, our elementary programs will be housed at Cost Cobb and our secondary programs are housed at Eastern Middle School. We are running from July 3rd to August 4th with no classes on the July 4th holiday. Programs run from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. depending on the program and student need. All ESY programs are from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. All academic intervention programs K-8 are from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. More information about GHS 9 through 12 courses can be found on our website. This summer, we are also bringing back, by popular demand, our tutoring option. We have increased from just literacy to both literacy and numeracy tutoring. We offer tutoring two to four times a week in 30 minute slots, running from 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. So far, we have 53 students enrolled and counting. Let's talk a bit about our inv invitation criteria. Our invited students are entering summer school for academic support, language support, math acceleration, and credit or recovery or advancement. We have a total of 20 pre-K to four sections in the elementary school six sections in grades five through eight, five middle level bridge courses, and we offer up to 24 courses for high school students. We currently have eight courses running for our GHS nine through 12 students. It's important to know that class enrollment increases drastically in the high school program as our finals approach. We will offer up to 24 courses based on student need. Confirmation of courses and up-to-date student enrollment is available just after final exams. All courses available are outlined on the GPS Summer School website. We are excited to announce our site supervisors this year are Anna Maria McCarthy and Matthew Hardigan. In addition to our administrators, we are employing general education, special education, support staff, and related service staff in our programs. Our students in K-4 will be engaging in 60 minutes of literacy support and 60 minutes of math support. All instruction is tailored to grade level needs. We plan to measure growth in reading using targeted assessments tailored to student needs at each individualized grade level. And in math, we are bringing back our pre and post big ideas math assessments. Our students in grades six through eight will utilize units of instruction from the previous year to review commonly missed or underperforming standards in ELA. Growth will be measured based on post unit assessments. Students will continue to use big ideas for math. Growth will be measured based on tailored assessments aligned with grade level needs. The team is excited to spend time with our students and staff this summer. We are confident that our summer school plans will support student needs and help them continue to grow. We look forward to coming back to the board in September to share out our future successes. Dr. Carabillo and I are available to answer any questions you may have at the live board report.